basically the faster we can machine a mold, the faster we can get production parts out, you know, and be ahead of our competition. We try to do 20 to 30 tools a year through our shop. So typically we'll, we'll get an order to make a chair mold. We'll build the mold here. We'll also make the tooling for forming, stamping, all inside of this shop. So we came up with a test part that was, I think it's five by five inches represents a current tool that we build. So we designed this part and then we involved other companies, other machines, had them run our program, our tooling, and that way we could get a good benchmark time. And we decided what was acceptable. You know, we looked at the fastest, we looked at the slowest. This part ran average about 35 minutes on the Mazak that we tested. We tested out on other equipment, our current machines that we have now is about an hour. Our new Mazak, when we got it in with the smooth control, was 29 minutes. And the finish was pretty good. Cool. Acceleration deceleration on a machine is very important. Especially where we have a lot of tight corners that we need to machine into. Peaks, valleys. Dwell time. You know, dwell time is bad. Usually when you're dwelling, you're leaving a mark on your part. So we're trying to eliminate the marks so we don't have sand. With the Mazak and the smooth control that we have, we're able to adjust that acceleration deceleration so that we can get in and out of the corners with very little slowdown. On our FJV, one of the selling points was the table size. Typically our molds are 42 inches wide and we bought the mill with a 55 inch table on it. So that allows us to not have to rotate parts to machine them. Good flat surface to mount the plates to. When we start with a raw piece of material, you know, we'll remove 20 to 50% of the material off of it by the time we're finished. We needed a fast machine. We needed to be able to rough fast, finish even faster. Roughing we're getting we're averaging uh, between 450 to 600 inches a minute. My current process with my older equipment, we're 100 inches a minute, 120 inches a minute. My employees here at Lifetime really enjoy running the Mazak. It's reduced their setup times, easier to load tools, great control, and it's a nice clean machine to run.